Hello, and today I'm going to teach you how you can solve linear sequences or arithmetic sequences, depends on whatever you want to call them, with a little formula. So we have a sequence 5, 7, 9, and 11, and we've been asked to find the nth term. So the way in which we do that is to apply the equation dn plus a minus d. Now this is in brackets for a good reason. So we know that the distance between these terms are plus 2. We can pretty much instantly figure that out because 5 plus 2 equals 7, 7 plus 2 equals 9, 9 plus 2 equals 11, and so on. So we know the distance is 2, so we can just sub in 2n, and we're going to have to add a minus d. Now what is a? a is basically the first term. Some people write this as u with the base of 1, or something like a or you know whatever they want to call it so i've called it called it a so all we need to do now is bracket we find the first term which is five five and then we're going to subtract the distance again so we know the distance is d and we know d is two so two so from this we can evaluate it to be two n plus three because five minus two is three and two n plus five minus two is three well, 2n plus 3. <laughs> so now we have the general term, which is 2n plus 3. We can apply it to test out our sequence. So like I said earlier, our sequence is 5, 7, 9, 11. We've been asked to find the nth term. So what we can do now is test it out by using our general term that we figured out in the last slide thing, which is 2n plus 3. So we can just sub in values of n, because this is 1, this is 2, this is 3, this is 4. Oops. Uh, this is term 1, term 2, term 3, and term 4, and that's the nth term, which is basically how to solve for every term. So 2n plus 3, we can sub in n as 1 to find the first term. 2 times 1 plus 3. 2 times 1 is 2, plus 3 is 5. We can try it again in case that was some sort of crazy fluke. We do 2 multiplied by 2 plus 3, which is 4 plus 3, which equals 7. So now we've already figured out the first two, and if you want to try it again, you can do 2 times 3 plus 3, which equals 9, and so on. So that's basically how you find the nth term, using the equation dn plus bracket a minus d. Hopefully you've learned something from this video, improved your mathematics, or reviewed this concept. Well, that's all I have to say, and good luck. Bye-bye.